What up, it's your boy Genius Collects back with another collection video. We back, baby. Hey, today I'm excited. We actually got something dope. We have a, um, we're basically doing a mystery box that is more of a traditional mystery box, right? Typically with Mystery Grail, which is still with Mystery Grail, I have just a little of the boxes where we open them up individually. They're individually wrapped in their own packaging. I think this one's a little different. Um, and I'm going to show y'all really quick. Um, we have the mystery box, the Marvel boy right here, the Marvel pack. So it comes with six different pops. It was worth 75 bucks. It is the, it's actually a guaranteed value of 75 bucks. We're going to at least get our money back with this box here or more. Um, it's six of them in here, which just feels kind of light and kind of small for it to be six pops, but it's very possible. I don't know. This is my first time opening up a traditional mystery box type of thing. And I think it's double boxed. Um, there's some top hits in this thing that I really wanted. I'll show y'all what that is right here. I'm really hoping for that. Uh, really, I want that Hawk. The Hawk or I want the, uh, the She-Hawk, <coughs> the, uh, the, the lawyer at law because that show is coming on, um, on Disney here soon. So either the Red Hawk or the She-Hawk are the ones I really, really want. Uh, or other than that, any other, uh, really grail. Let me get a grail one time from y'all. <laughs> uh, but... I'm excited. Uh, before we get started, though, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that notification bell so we all like this type of content where it's collecting. Um, subscribe to me. You know, if y'all like it, hit that like button to go ahead so we can have more people see it. It's free. Help your boy out so I can get out there in the algorithm, please. Um, and if Y'all wanna know I collect? I collect some of everything. As you can see behind me, I collect Funko Pops, which is my whole wall. I collect shoes, which is, you know, right here too. You can kind of see it. I got my shoe collection right here as well. Um, and I collect uh, sports cards and Pokemon cards as well. So if y'all like that stuff, y'all like content about collecting, join the family, baby. Join the family. But without further ado, I'm excited. Let's crack this thing open. I don't know what side is up or down, but let's start with down so we don't open and see it because I want it to be a mystery and I want to um, find out with y'all same time y'all find out so let's see uh, what we can get in this thing well I already jacked up the tape not a hook boom okay is this like let me see uh, it looks like yes it's a box within a box all right so first off you get one scratch off ticket it seems so i got my scratch off we're we'll scratch that off at the end oh actually i scratch that off first typically i scratch it off at the end so let's scratch that off first but first let's get out this mystery box and it does come with um tootsie pop and two tootsie pops it looks like yep two tootsie pops so you still get your candy you still get your uh, your scratch off card uh and you get your six so this feels it, it can be, it's definitely six up in here. It, it feels like more like six now that I'm actually holding the actual box. Uh, and I'm trying to fill it to see if it feels like a hard stack is on one end of it. it. I can't really tell. This end feels heavier than the other, but let's do the scratch off first and let's see if we get something. Get something pretty cool for buying a mystery box. Maybe they gave us a, a new... Let's see. Nope. Uh, nope. So... Same old thing, 200 um, scratch offs right there. Um, so, uh, 200 points, I'm sorry. Um, there I go towards my uh, collection. I haven't spent any points yet, so I'm trying to build that up. So, let me go ahead and try and open this to make sure I don't see what's in here. I don't know which side is right side up, which side is upside down. So, let's just go ahead and take a guess that this one is the one that has the pops that are upside down. Hopefully I'm right. What, did I not cut this all the way through? Boom, come on. All right, so I gotta be careful this time. I can't really just cut like that because I'm cutting the actual, let me see. I think that that is showing the actual pop. I just seen the top of it says pop. I didn't see what was in there, but said pop so let me let me readjust here guys come on now let's see if this is the bottom so, okay so this is the bottom right here boom we're we're good now 
it doesn't feel like I got a horror stack in here. And none of these have, um, typically they have the, um, them in the seven bucks a box, box pop shield protector or whatnot, but they don't have it in these. So, these are all upside down as you can see, so I can't see anything. Boom, all upside down and all look like newer pops right here as well. And none of them came in a hard stack, so <laughs> I didn't get a top hit. Darn it. All right, let's start with the first one. Let's see what we got. Oh, shoot, let me grab this correctly. Oh, ruin in the box. All right. So, boom, right here. Okay, so this may be cool. I got a gambit from it looks like the back of it. It is a glow-in-the-dark gambit um, pop. That's not bad. Yeah, that should be worth uh, it. It's, it's funny because um, Entertainment Earth, they're exclusive. I don't know if people just don't like Entertainment Earth. Their exclusives really don't go for very much, even though their exclusives are pretty cool, glow-in-the-dark typically type of pops, but they usually don't go for very much. But Gambit, we'll check what the pricing is at the end. All right. Boom. That one we have looks like Captain America from the back Civil or uh, Captain America is a Civil War. Yeah, Civil War. Uh, oh, okay. So this one's not bad. It actually has the the right sticker or the sticker that everyone loves, the GameStop. So Captain America, um, Civil War. Okay. That one's that one's not bad either. Yeah, it's gonna be all Marvel pops. It, um, so you can't really go wrong with an all Marvel pack. Boom, second one. Oh, Doctor Doom, Fantastic Four, this one. This box is a little damaged, actually, from the side right here. That, that's a little damaged there, but... Okay, Doctor Doom, that may be a good one right there because they're, they're teasing Doctor Doom coming soon, so this may be a pretty good one right here. How old is it? This is a 2019 pop right here. So, it's a little damaged. It's a damage right there on the top, and then it's damaged right there at the bottom, too. So a bit of damage on that one there. All right, let's so keep it moving. This is my next pop that is a boom. Okay, what is this one? Gwenpool? Uh, uh, this one's new to me. Um, This one is a, what year was this? Can't even find the year that this one was manufactured. I don't see it in the outlook later, but boom, Gwenpool. Um, yeah, I'm not. I'm not even. I haven't seen this one before. I'm not even familiar with this at all. Um, but pretty cool. Just a just a girl version of uh, Deadpool. They do have a Gwen from Spider-Man, so Gwen Stacy. She is the female Spider-Man, but are they representing her as the female Deadpool too? I'm not sure. Y'all get in the comments and let me know a little bit about the Gwenpool. This is new to me. And it's older too. You can tell from the bobblehead. But Next one is another Fantastic Four. Okay, so Silver Surfer from the back. It looks like this one was produced. Um, here is 2019. Okay, so Silver Surfer. This was actually pretty cool. Let me show you another look at that one. So Silver Surfer. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, yeah. I'll definitely take it. And last but not least, this is a newer one. I don't think it's going to be that good. Uh, this one is going to be uh, Hawkeye. Okay. It's from Hawkeye, is it? Yeah, yeah. Yelena. So the first Yelena pop that was from the movie Black, the Black Widow's first movie. That pop is going crazy. The, this Yelena, I don't think that this one is worth very much. Um, that one is worth like hundreds, a hundred bucks or so. I'm not sure what this one is here. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, but yeah, last pop is Yelena. This was a newer pop. I knew that because it had the blue bar coating right there. Um, this one is a, I want to say a 2020 pop. When is this? 2021. This one's a 2021 pop. Um, but yeah. Yeah, so, not bad, not a bad haul. I didn't hit a top hit, a very upsetting, uh, but it's okay. But let's check the value of what we have real quick. Um, and as you guys know, I use a Funko app so I can see if it is actually vaulted. So give me a little bit more detail so I can let you guys know exactly how much it's worth if it's vaulted and uh, my opinion of the pops. Um, so let's start with the last first. Last one is from Hawkeye, Yelena. Where is my barcode? Boom. 
this one, Yelena, it, it, it's um, a chase that this one, you can hit, get a possible chase with this one. I did not hit the chase. The one that's not the chase is 15 bucks. So this one's 15 bucks. This one's obviously not vaulted because it came out in 2021. But Yelena, 15 bucks. Yeah. You know, about what I expected. I didn't think it was going to be worth that much. Um, but let's go into the second pop here. This one is the Fantastic Four Silver Surfer. Let's see. Now, I'm, I, I'm, this one's only 14 bucks. This one came out in 2019. Dang, where's my, where's my, where's my, uh, my, uh, actual value at? Because this is supposed to be worth at least 75 bucks. So 15, 14, currently we only had 29 bucks. So 14 bucks for Silver Surfer. This one may be a good one as well. So 14 bucks. Nah. Let's go on to the Gwen. Now, this one I'm very curious about because I couldn't find the. So it's had. This used to be ten bucks. This was a pretty old one, I think. This one may be my value right here. This may be the one that's. Oh no, it's not. <laughs> this one is a 2017 vaulted Gwen pool. Nine bucks. Nine bucks. Now I'm confused. I'm not sure where my. Um, value is because we're currently only at 38 i don't know which one of these is going to really <laughs> be my value maybe it's the damage one it's the doctor um dr doom one um but and this one is not either this one isn't very valuable came out in 2019 not voted still available this one's only worth 11 dollars. so we're at 49 dollars currently so I got two more, which uh, one be worth twenty bucks, other worth some. Oh uh, yeah, let's say let me, let's, let's let's scan this one next. I know this one isn't worth very much. Uh, like I said, these um, Entertainment Earth stickers or people that don't like Entertainment Earth, I'm not sure, but they're never really worth very much, even though they're cool pops. Um, this was nineteen, so there's some of my value right there. So nineteen bucks right there, um, added to the forty nine. Um, so, uh, so yeah, that's gonna be so. This last pop has to be worth at least what seven bucks or so, and that puts me at the guaranteed value. That was 19, that was my very um, that was, that was my, my value right there. I wouldn't have guessed that, but and it's a newer pop too, so um, darn. Uh, this one here, Captain America with the right sticker, this one could be a good value right here. It's older. Has to be like a 2019, 2017, something like that. I'll find out by scanning. This one is okay. So this was my most value. This makes sense. This one's 27 bucks. So that, that throws me over my goal right there. Um, this is a 2016 Vaulted Pop. Not bad. And this one, out of all of them, I would probably say this is my favorite one right here, too. Even though we got, like, tons of Captain America pops. Um, I would probably say that that one is probably my uh, my favorite one out of all of them. Um, but adding them all up, the total value of everything ends up coming out to 94 bucks. So I got over my value. That was actually paid for shipping, too, because with shipping, it was 85 So I'm about 9 bucks over value plus shipping. So... Not bad, may value, disappointed that I didn't get a star. I really wanted that Red Hulk or that She-Hulk. Those, one of those two would have been pretty cool. Um, but it's okay. Tell me that y'all get a box, that y'all hit something big. What y'all think about these here that I have? That's it. I'm kind of upset. I want, I want that Red Hulk, man. Come on, Mystery Grail, show me love. <laughs> but I know going into it, that the odds are stacked against you for actually getting the grail and that's fine but i'm willing to take a risk at times and you know try and get that get that get that big hit but it's been genius collects thank y'all for watching if y'all hadn't hit that subscribe button make sure y'all hit that i'll talk to y'all next time